Well, it is another big day at the Indiana State Fair. You are looking live right now at the fairgrounds off here in the distance. It's band day, always a huge day for mm -hmm. high school kids around the state. Travis Tritt is on the free stage tonight, but at its core, the fair is all about celebrating the state's farmers and agriculture. WRTV's Kyle Mounts joining us tonight live from the fair with a type of Indiana farming that may surprise you. This is an interesting one, Kyle. Yeah, Mark and Nicole, we are at the Indiana State Fair and we are at Pioneer Village where you can step back in time, learn about farming back in the 18 and early 1900s. In fact, they've been literally sawing logs throughout the afternoon there, giving some demonstrations. But fast forward here to 2022, and earlier I got the chance to talk with one of the featured farmers here at the Indiana State Fair, and he is going high tech to provide some produce to his community. In the middle of this east side community, it doesn't look like there's a lot of space for developing produce, but inside these shipping containers, three and a half acres are really growing. I wanted an opportunity to get into farming. I want an opportunity to establish a business system and also to have a business that gives back to the community. Demario Vitalis is doing just that with an urban farm on East 10th Street he calls New Age Provisions. Vitalis says he didn't have any experience with farming, but knew he wanted to provide fresh produce to his community. So to get started, he turned to a unique solution hydroponic farming inside shipping containers. All right, we're about to blow your mind, man. Come on inside. These containers are a turnkey solution. Uh, it's a freight farm shipping container, which we purchased from a company in Boston, Massachusetts. Everything is controlled by the Agrotech right here, and it has a climate sensor. Inside, the container is decked out with temperature and humidity sensors, as well as automated nutrient and light systems. In a way, this allows Vitalis to control the weather growing lettuce, kale, and leafy greens, whether we're experiencing extreme heat and drought or the frigid temperatures of an Indiana winter. Inside, we have the ability to program the temperature. We could keep it the same temperature year round. Uh, we have ability to control the humidity. Uh, we have an ability to control the pH, the nutrients that the plants receive. So we take these pods and we put them inside the trays. After a few days, the plants will sprout. Vitalis oversees the entire growing process with the help of just one other employee. From seed to harvest, that's about six to eight weeks. We take our seeds, we put them into the grow pods, let them grow to become seedlings, and then from the seedling stage, we'll transfer them into the towers. The growth towers are where the crops mature and get ready for harvest. Stacking the plants vertically means each shipping container can grow up to 13,000 plants at any one time. And unlike traditional farming, Vitalis doesn't harvest the entire plant at once. This allows him to continuously have crops growing at various stages. When we harvest, within 24 hours, it's in the hands of the consumer. So you, you get the opportunity to, to try some of the freshest lettuce, some of the freshest kale, some of the freshest leafy greens you ever had. Vitalis is leading the way with his unique operation. He's the first person to bring container farming to Indiana, and his efforts are being recognized. Vitalis is being honored as a featured farmer at this year's Indiana State Fair. It just gives me a feeling of pride that I can't represent for the city and for my people. As for the future, just like the towering plants inside, Vitalis is looking to new heights. With our system, we could literally scale up by putting these containers on top of each other. So we can go from 3.5 acres to 7 acres, from 7 to 14 by scaling up. And if you would like to order some lettuce or kale from New Age Provisions, just go to marketwagon.com. You can place your order for delivery there. You